Well, hey guys, always trying to get better and come up with some new solutions uh, to make our products work better and more efficient. So check this out. I uh, just received my Galaxy um, Gear 360, which is a 360 degree camera, and we use it to do interior 360 degree videos. And so one of the challenges we have is where do we put it? How do we get a good picture of the interior of a car? Do we set it down low? Do we set it on a tripod? How do we get it done? Well, here's a solution that I came up with that I think might be uh, doable. Go on uh, Amazon and order yourself some of these neodyme uh, magnets. They're like usually like two or three for fifteen dollars, so they're not cheap, but they're super powerful. And you can thread a, a quarter inch screw up through the middle. Make sure you get the ones that are recessed. And then on the bottom of your 360, you've got this quarter inch eye bolt, or hole I should say. And then you just screw this into that bolt, or nut, or screw, or whatever they call it. And once it's in there, now you'll see that it actually sticks up to the ceiling just like that nice and easy and I wouldn't recommend driving around with it but it does take a little bit to get it down so if you're just doing that quick and dirty uh, video or photo it's a pretty easy way to do it and it minimizes the amount that you need to carry around with you um, the other thing you could do is you could pick up one of these off of Amazon and this is a threaded extender so if you want to drop it a little bit further away from the from the uh, ceiling, this is I think about a th three inch extension that goes on here. And you can see I'm just screwing it right onto the uh, right onto the magnet, just like so. And you could probably do this with a Theta S as well. And then you just screw this right on here, tighten it down. Try to do it with one hand so I won't be able to get it as tight as I'd like, but it doesn't matter. So now I've got it like this with the magnet on the end, and now I can just go ahead and bam, drop it up in there, step out of the car, take my picture, come back, pull it down, and move on. So just an idea I thought you guys might appreciate. I do know that not every car has a magnetic surface right in this area. A lot of them do that have this light. So if you're searching to put it up there, definitely want to go up near the light. And it's not getting actually the, the outside of the car panel. It's picking up on the frame for this uh, light. So just another easy way to use the tool. Thanks for watching.